Our Sherry, a woman shot and killed in Springfield Township, the suspect in the hospital after shooting himself. We first told you about this story as breaking news last night on 9 on your side at 11. Now for the first time we're hearing from the mother of Kenesha Moore. 9 on your side's Jake Ryle talked with her one on one about how she wants her daughter to be remembered. Jake heartbroken Tanya Moore, the mother of Kenesha Moore, who was killed Friday night. No, she'll never have her daughter back, but now the focus is on remembering the positives, a life that brought so many smiles to everyone she knew. A mother flipping through pictures. She loved life. She loved family. Memories. When you see her, you just couldn't help but smell at her because that's what she gave off. Tanya Moore says the 21 year old in those pictures is her daughter, Kanisha, one of six children. Now look at me. I see her. I see her. My baby. And I don't want her remembered as this tragedy. I want them to know my baby for who she was. He took my angel. Springfield Township Police say Kenesha Moore was shot and killed Friday night on Tag Drive. The suspect took off but was tracked down by police. After that, he managed to shoot himself. I don't want to say too much about him because that was too bad. Tanya believes she knows the suspect who police believe killed her daughter. She had issues with him before even in grieving, a mother focusing on her daughter's smile. I want to remember her as that. I don't want to remember what happened to her like that. She says her future was only looking up. Enrolled at Miami University, and she was so excited. She wanted to major in theater. She wanted to start acting and modeling. That was her goal. A future she'll never know. Words can't express how I feel right now. A parent shouldn't have to bury their child. It should be the opposite way around. A grieving mother simply wanting to reflect. I miss this. This is what I miss. This was her. And I don't want nobody to forget her. I think she touched everybody's heart. And she took a piece of mine. Now the family tells me they have not made funeral arrangements yet. Once we do know more, we'll be sure to keep you updated. Jake Ryle, 9 on your side.